What's up everyone? Manny G back here, back at it again. And today I'm here to show you how to get some iced coffee while watching your calories because we all want that summer body, but we don't want to neglect our nice little iced coffee cravings. So let's get started. Okay, so now that you have all your ingredients, so we have our ice, as you can see. You're at worst we need some water, so we have some water. Straight, there's no special kind of water, this is like straight from the sink. So, you know, water, you can buy the water, you know, be like me, it's just from the sink, because it's drinkable, thank God. And you also gonna need one of these little things called Mio Energy. Um, you can actually find this ones at almost any gas station. Uh, Walmart has a lot of them, but this is the one I'm gonna use because today the topic is iced coffee. Uh, so this is what it looks like if you want to go shopping later. Hopefully, because you know you'll want to try this out yourself. As you can see, iced vanilla Java. Um, like I said, there's multiple flavors of this. By the way, quick time out. Um, you can't see my face um, because I have a big body, uh, you know, I'm swole. But <laughs> it is the, kind of like the best way for me to be able to really show you how I'm making this. So, yes, no, it's still me. Okay, me. But due to the space that, you know, I have around here, that's what it is. Anyway, let's get back to it. So, you're gonna need your eyes, your nice little meal. I like meal because it's it's fairly cheap and the flavor is great. But anyway, um, you know your water and then uh, an empty water bottle or you know just a cup, your choice really. Um, for bottle, I like to use a shaker bottle. Um, yes, because I find it easier that. You can, you know, shake things a little easier. It looks cool, you know. You should change the Bible. Oh, that guy lives. He knows what's up. Or that girl lives. She knows. So anyway, let's get started. So, you know, the first time the lid. Then we're gonna add the ice first. So. You can, add, you can add as much ice as you personally like. Um, me, I'm a big fan of having a lot of ice because I like my drinks extremely cold, especially something like iced coffee. I feel like if you're drinking some sort of warm version of iced coffee, you're missing the point of iced coffee. But anyway, as you can see, I fill it up quite top heavy. Um, then you can put some water in it. As you can see, the water I'm using is room temperature, so obviously the ice melted a little bit. Nothing too bad, okay? And now, what you're gonna do is, with this beautiful creation, I swear whoever created this is a genius because it is the best thing ever. You're gonna put a couple of squirts on it because this is a concentrated formula, okay? Concentrated formula means it's very, very strong. You're supposed to take it with water so that it levels it out. If you just take it like that, I mean props to you, it's not going to taste the best. So if you want to do it, be my guess, I'm not going to stop you. But anyway, so you're going to put a couple squirts on it. The thing about this, when you're squirting it, is the more you, the more squirts or the more substance you put into your water, the stronger it's going to be. The flavor is going to be a lot stronger. So it can be a good thing or a bad thing, depending on what kind of coffee drink you're at. So for me, I usually do Three or four, it's it's a trial and error thing, you know. So it's how much you like it and trial and error of how much water you have or so. So for this one, for this particular cup, um, we'll try, let's go with three, so, no, let's go four solid squirts. So, let's go. Two, three, four. Let's do one more for good luck. Five. As you can see, it's transforming. 
now we just close it to the left. And this one, I think the shaker bottle will work the best. You can use any kind of water bottle you want, but I mean, with this one having such a big opening, you can put like uh, the ice on it a lot easier, rather than you just have a, a normal water bottle like this. It'll be a pain, but again, it's, it's how you want it. So, and that's the final thing. Let's see, so that was five squirts. Um, when I say five squirts, I mean one, two, three, you know, I didn't like hold one, two, so I mean, it's, some people can do it that way. Again, it depends on, you know, how you want it. Let's have a sip. Wow, it's actually pretty good. Um, in the terms that I have never used this bottle before to make iced coffee. I should use something like this, as you can see, big diff size difference. Um, again, like I said, you can use anything you want to uh, make this creation happen. Uh, in fact, you know, let's use this little cup this time. So, you know, we put our eyes in there, as you can see. Since this cup is, you know, we'll have less, we we'll just do, we'll do three, we'll do three this time. So, one, two, three. Huh. I forgot a spoon. Hmm. Well, you know what? Sometimes you have to improvise. That's what we got, fingers. <laughs> Now try not to do this, I mean, it's very, if you're drinking it to yourself, okay, but if you're going to give this to somebody else, don't do it, don't be lazy like me and go get a freaking spoon, that's it, okay, let's try this one out. Again, awesome, um, not as strong as the other one, but again, like I said, it just kind of depends on, uh, okay, so I'm done with this, and so now you guys can actually see my face. Good, sweet. So, like I said, you can try this many in many different ways. Um, you could even try it with milk, 